All right, so in this video, we're gonna talk about test suites. What test suites are used for in regard to UI testing is it's used for bundling up a bunch of test classes so you can run them all at the same time. So um, I'll just, uh, let's just, let's just get right into it. So right now in Android Studio, I have two test classes, main activity test, just has some basic kind of activity tests here, launching an activity scenario, checking to see if a certain thing is in view, some very simple tests. Uh, these might have changed, by the way, since the, the previous video that you watched because I, uh, I, I wasn't following the, the branch on, that I created on Git, so it might look a little different, but they're largely the same, so just don't worry if you see something that's like a little different. So anyway, so the second class here is secondary activity, and we have an activity rule, but again, just, just testing some basic kind of activity stuff. So what if I wanted to run all of these tests at the same time. So right now I have two test classes. What if I wanted to run them at the same time? So I'm gonna right click on main, go to new Kotlin file, and we're gonna call this the activity, activity test suite. So not a, very, not a very creative name, but that's what we're testing. We're testing two activities, so that naming does make sense. So first I'll get the uh, class here, and we're not gonna actually need to write anything within the class. We're not gonna add a constructor to it or anything, but we're gonna add an annotation, so at run with, we want to do suite class. I need an extra colon here. And then I need another annotation. And this is gonna be at suite.suite classes. And this I wanna open up. And then inside of here is where I'm gonna reference the, the, two, the two classes that we're gonna test. So in this case, we have main activity test, and then just do class. And we have the secondary activity test. So secondary activity test, and then class. And so now, now if I want to run these two tests, if I wanna run the entire suite, I just wanna right click on the activity test suite and go to run. And now those two test classes will run one after the other. All right, there go our test, instantiating the test. I don't know why, but my, my, my build took like a really long time to get started here, but it looks like it's, uh, looks like it's working now. Okay, so first uh, testing, it looks like testing the main activity. Looking good, looking good, looking good. There's our three tests. And now it's moving on to the next one. So you can see it's gone over to the secondary activity test and going through those uh, those tests. So pretty straightforward. Again, nothing really incredibly difficult here, but um, definitely something you need to know. Uh, so test suites. So now in the next video, I'll just bring up my my lecture outline here. In the next video, we are gonna work on the Firebase Test Lab. So I'm gonna show you how to get started with Firebase Test Lab, how to run your first test using Firebase Test Lab. Um, we'll talk a little bit about the pricing. Um, so we'll, we'll do some free tests and then I'll, I'll talk about the pricing and how that works. And we'll run some, some tests using the Test Lab. So I'll see you in the next video.